Alright. No, I'm not a party, I better do that before I get some <laughs> strange. <laughs> I never realised Ben actually set a custom mode message. Yes, I I'm streaming alone on the syndicate. <laughs> Hello Nathan. Uh, yes, I'm streaming alone on the Syndicate one because I was signed in for Halo Game Night and I just couldn't be bothered changing to my personal, so it's like... <laughs> uh, who cares? Not me. So, I'm gonna, I've am gonna. i got seven days to run through... What's up Nathan? Uh, I'll tell you what's up. I've got seven days to run through the No Man's Sky community thing. And I'm at the very beginning and it's... <laughs> it's quite a long quest. Or like, series of quests. And I really want to finish it, so I'm gonna I'm gonna stream a lot, and then just upload it all just without editing to YouTube and just try and get it done. Uh, <laughs> feel free to join if you want. Um, I'll just be kind of like running about. I might get joined by some EPM people. Um, I was gonna put this in Discord, but I just couldn't be bothered. As I said, I'm just doing this because I'm gonna be here anyway. So I thought, why not? That's why we used to. Do. <laughs> you know, we gotta get back to streaming just for fun. Uh, there we go, it's finally done loading. I forget how long the load times are for this game. Yeah, Nathan, I, I'm playing on a, on a, on a new save. Uh, so <laughs> I'm at the beginning of the game. Um, this is just where um, you go onto a special save and you complete quests. As you can see, I've got a rubber ship. It's broken. Uh, just let me know if you want. Actually, I'll just put my game on open so you can just join. Uh, as you see, I've got all these quests and stuff. Um, this is different from the normal game. It's called Expedition Mode. It's very new. Um, so you go through the different phases and... Oh boy, this could take some time. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's an excuse to play the game. So, uh, general options. How do I do this again? Network, I think? Oh, nice, nice. Freighters are very good. Um, anyone can join my group. Uh, allow PvP? I'm gonna turn that off. Because it's just not something I want to deal with just now. <laughs> you know? Uh, right, so let's figure out where we are. Repair critical ship systems, launch thrusters, and pulse engine. So let's see what we need for our pulse engine. Metal plate- oh no, I need the hermetic seal. Now I see why I stopped playing this save. Ooh, what is that? Oh, X-class module, 82%. Uh, so I notice on expedition mode you do start with some, uh, some nice little things. Like a S and B class random stuff, you know. Normally you start with nothing, but they obviously they really mix things up with expedition mode. Yeah, see, there's people trying to kill me already, so I'm just let's just pretend it is not happening and go on our way. Did that upset the Sentinels, though. Why are they after me? <laughs> go away. Just trying to live my life, man. Yeah, I better get out of here. I don't ex Right, okay, let's go. Um, how do I access my quests? Expedition.
Okay, so I need this. Okay, I need to enter the ship to get the specific guidance. So it's, it's been a long time since I did this. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, chromatic seal. Um. For me? Oh, there's so many little, um, things on the map. It's very difficult to tell if this is the building I'm supposed to go into. Might. You should be. That's just a first aid kit. Or a first aid station as we know it in space. Nanites. Lovely. Because I, um... I know the strategy for this is just um, get all the nanites and credits you can, units, sorry, uh, and just focus on getting some S-Class modules. Okay, so give me the advice. Yes, yes, I know it's damaged. Yeah, you gotta show me, <laughs> show me the marker, come on. I really hope this save's not bugged. By pinning components. Okay. You repair instructions. There we go. Craft or purchase hermetic seal. Wait, oh, I can craft it? Oh, there. Oh, see, this is different from how you play the main game. The main game, you have to go and find it. I need condensed carbon, and they're giving the blueprint, which is fair enough. I can, I can deal with that. So let's get a little bit of carbon going. And then we can get on our way. And get some condensed carbon down the line when I've got enough fuel. Okay, condensed carbon. That's like the weird red crystals, so... Ooh, this could take some time to find can <laughs> If it's... Nearby. Yeah, there's some dihydrogen. That's the blue crystals. I need the red ones. <laughs> or something that contains... Ooh, what about the cacti? Carbon. 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 I have a feeling about cactus flesh had something to do with carbon. But I... yeah. Okay, let's just go find condensed carbon. We need it. What the fuck is that? The Man. Let's give it... oh, it's already scanned. Um, quest. It's 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 back to the basics of No Man's Sky. Civ, Civ for so long, and having all my decked out uh, vectors and Reaper class ships and all that stuff. I mean, Civ life is fun. Don't get me wrong. It's just once you've done it, you've done it. You know. This is things in No Man's Sky that I mean, my main save. I've done a lot. I've got like two hundred hours in it, which I know isn't a lot for. Some people. Oh, there's some condensed carbon. Uh, I was saying I haven't like touched any. Um, so this I think forces me to tame pets and stuff. So should be an experience because I won't have done everything in the game, just a lot of it. All right, condensed carbon. Come on. Is this going to be enough to get hermetic suit? Okay, it is. Let's grab it all anyway because you always need. That kind of thing. Okay, right, exosuit. Static seal. Now we need metal plating, which is ferrite dust. I don't even have any ferrite dust. <laughs> now I suppose we can start making our way back up to the, the ship. What is that? Copper. Oh, I will need copper, so let's pick up some copper. I will need a lot of copper. I'm just trying to think ahead here. Um, <laughs> the benefits of knowing some things in this game, but not everything. Alright, terrain manipulator. Uh, let's go for the super fine one. For those who don't know, the small one gives more resources than the big one, but costs more energy. Uh, fun fact. I, I learned that like, midway through my game. I was kind of like, oh, well, now I have more resources than I know what to do with anyway, but most of the time I just use the 
when I am mining the ground, the big one, because it's more energy efficient. Uh, this is this is fine for when you actually need resources. I'm actually just getting a lot of silica, silica powder. Give me all your copper! It's fine, because the silica powder can recharge the terrain manipulator as well, which is always lovely. I'm only getting powder. Where is my copper? There we go. No, I want to get a healthy amount, because I, I know you need a lot of copper. Um, and I don't think I have been given a personal refiner, out of all the things I have been given. And then we'll hit this up into chromatic metal. Uh, thermal protection, yes, yes, I don't have any sodium. That's gonna be fun when that happens. You always forget the desert planet is cold. Hopefully a good chunk. Uh, 377. Uh, let's go for 450. Don't know why that number, but that's the one I'm going to go for. Uh, I did. I did see a video by Zane's World talking about the strategy. I got like two minutes into it, and it's like I'm just going to play it my own way. And if I need help, I'll like getting it done quickly. I'll look, watch it, and I yeah, I posted it in EPM, but I didn't actually use it myself. I'm just going to play at my own pace, unless I get to the point where I, I need to finish, in which case I'll be streaming a lot more trying to get this done. Hopefully that's not the case, I don't want to rush this, I want to just take it at my own pace. Um, if I, yeah, Maybe I should have started sooner then, if I wanted to be like that, but yeah, it is what it is. I just, uh, alright, so where's my ship? Is that mine over there? Nope. Oh, what are these things? Oh, don't go away. Okay. Now the trick is finding my starship in amongst all this nonsense. My starship. Okay, it's gonna be a bit of a pain to navigate, but I'm confident we can get back up there. have to cross this big gap and I <laughs> I have to remember that I don't have my usual S-Class jetpack and all its accoutrements. Oh no, oh no, oh it's going bad. Oh. Yeah, this is what I didn't want to happen. Ah, oh, bother. What are these things? Floating crystal. Wow. Well, that's cool. Oh, oh damn. Run, run. <laughs> Not a good time down there. Not doing too hot on all my resources and my life support systems. Yep, so we're just gonna have to run about a bit. Go around this pit I've fallen into. a little bit more. Mm. I mean, it, <laughs> yeah, I've been putting this off for a while, doing this expedition stuff. I mean, the only other games I've been playing is Outriders. Um, I haven't streamed it though, just kind of chilling out, playing Outriders. Um, open this Star Trek Online of all things an event going on just now and I've gotten really into it for some reason like I used to play it <laughs> ironically but now I'm really doing it unironically and I can see why people just especially Star Trek fans enjoy just flying about and pew pewing as they say <laughs> I was gonna refine chromatic 
metal, wasn't I? Alright, yes, yes, I know what you're doing. Uh, bit of a lag there. Just always like to restore. And... Oh yes, there it is. It's right there. How do I build portable refiner? There we go. And we'll pop in our last bit of... Let's go with the condensed carbon. And we will put in... Our copper. Yep, yeah, so it actually it has a 2 to 1 ratio. Which I had forgotten about. Um, so you can see that here. Two copper produces one chromatic metal. Um, I'm not too worried about resources just now because I have a feeling that once I get to some of the the checkpoints, uh, there'll be a lot of mines, like player mines, which I can just uh, get for money at uh, units, sorry, and resources. Uh, so I'll get to 100 here. How much fuel have we got there? Okay, let's. Or let's get to 50%. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Okay, that should be. I can refine more later, I just don't really want to sit here and do this thing that I used to. In the Civ days, I would sit by uh, my big rusted metal mines and I would have just infinite ferrite. So it's. Some may say I'm not patient, but then they don't know that I used to do that. Just sit for hours. I didn't pick up the ferrite. Um, so yes, I could sit and watch that fine, but I don't intend to. <laughs> uh, that's not a pure ferrite rock. I want to get a pure, uh, a pure regular ferrite rock, should I say, rather than a pure, pure ferrite rock. Yeah, see, oh, gotta pay more attention. Let's get a little bit of ferrite. See, it's it's ferrite and pyrite. But, um, what else do we do? Metal plating. Um, any big rocks around here? I can mine for a second. I can always sell the pyrite, to be honest. And I think it's actually a fuel source, is it not? Pyrite. Yes. I might be able to use pyrite in fueling my launch thrusters, is it? Or not hyperdrive. Probably launch thrusters. Or pulse engine, or one of the engines. Okay, let's give it a go. And a one, and a two, and we're back. Uranium, you take pyrite, which is disappointing. I've got lots of tritium. Okay, let's go. Launch ship and go to the stars, head to the stars even. I don't normally fly explorers. But uh, for this expedition, I feel it is necessary to get that maximum warp range, because as you may or may not know... Okay, good galaxy. Uh, explorers have bonus warp range, fighters damage, etc, uh, etc. Et what does it want me to install? Install a hyperdrive? Oh right, I need a hyperdrive, which is the chromatic metal I didn't... <laughs> Joy of joy, I need more chromatic metal. And I don't really want to buy it when I have that copper, because I'm going to need to buy microprocessors. Great, you're a genius. <laughs> okay, so how do we want to play this? Um, first of all, let's switch back from first person. Oh, this... Actually, I can dig this ship. Oh, I'll, I'll get used to it. Uh, so... Yeah, I just need to refine the... The chromatic metal. Interesting, I've got all kind of green trails and stuff. <laughs> Pro EPM, am I right? That's their colours, green. 
Uh, I'm actually going to have to land. Hopefully there's a settlement that has a landing pad because I don't really want to have to. Or do I have a personal refiner? I should have checked. Nope, I don't. And you cannot play- ugh, sorry, it's land anywhere. Ooh, actually, there are bases. These bases probably have... ...what I need. Let's fly up into the atmosphere. And down to some sketchy looking base. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna regret this. Maybe, maybe. Maybe, maybe not. It's not loading in yet, so there's no way to know. Or is it super small? I think it's just not loaded in yet. Please have a landing pad. Yes, landing pad. Let's see if they've actually got anything else I can go for as well. <laughs> And I missed it. Okay. Take two. Landing sequence unavailable. What? Maybe explorers just have some kind of weird hitbox I'm just not aware of. Right, slow and steady. Slow it. Why did it not... Is this a glitched landing pad? There we go. Alright, so let's see what this place has to offer me. Hopefully a refiner. Okay, I'm not going to ask for too much, but it'd be nice if it had a refiner. Just to save me carbon. Got to skimp on all my resources just now. Unlike the old days where I could just do whatever. Oh, yes, he has a refiner. That looks like a portable one, though. Nothing of interest. Let's see what this building has. It's just a standard building. A few crates that I can pilfer. Condensed carbon, you love to see it. It's got a vendor as well, what have you got? Technology merchant, oh no. <laughs> damn. Damn, damn, damn. That's a lot of money. I don't have. The Ooh. let's not get distracted. I did see a thing. Yeah, I'm looking right at it. Let's see what the price of okay, it's the same. We are gonna need to get a fair bit of units then to afford these microprocessors. Now, to get some units, we're gonna need to do some work. That means finding work. So, to the station we go. Unless some good Samaritan just happens to drop me some fat monies. Um, but again, saying that, that always kind of ruined it in the game. Early in my game I got some stasis devices. Well, that's it, early, it was like mid-game for me. Um, when the anomaly kind of just... It was new, and duping was new, and you didn't really know what was going on. Uh, there's nothing in it. Uh, could you not have placed? Do 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 do. That sounds like Outlook. I wonder. Right, chromatic metal. I will do this while I check my emails because someone's sending me something. Requested operation unavailable. That's because I just put chromatic metal in there. What am I doing? Pay attention, Matthew. Uh, what am I even in here for? Copper. Copper to copper to chromatic metal. Excellent, excellent. Okay, well this refines. And it is nothing exciting. Actually, what is that? Oh, I forgot I'm going to do an update on my phone as well later. We'll do that 
after the stream. <laughs> or after how long I even play No Man's Sky for, not just necessarily the stream. Alright, almost done. See, I should have just waited the first time, but thankfully... What's this? Oh. There we go. That's cool. There we go. Some chromatic metal. More than I need, but I have a feeling I'll need more. Oh, you've just taken my... Oh, I am not a smart one. Can you give me my resources back? No. Alright, well, thanks for your refiner, mate. You can keep the carpet. <laughs> I should have used my own one. Damn it! Ah, oh, that's frustrating. Stupid like that. Maybe these buildings will have something that will compensate my loss. Some nanites, because I'm going to need them. You have learned the word for Corvax for Corvax. Navigation data, very important. And if not, I'll just sell it. <laughs> need the monies right now. Recharge life support. So one of those things in here that will do it for me. Without wasting my resources. <laughs> my very finite resources. Or finite. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's do a quick save and... At least I'll look like empty anyway. Camp Logdan Kobo. Will I butchered that? Alright, rusted metal. Lovely, lovely. And navigation data. You know, people don't tend to pick up that because of the rusted metal, but I. Ooh, and microprocessors! This is a good way of exploring, isn't it? Getting microprocessors. Is that two? Oh, yes! We are doing. Oh, fine. Just don't have much to my name just now. Uh, can I get some good stuff? Ooh, Corvax, yeah, I'm gonna sell that. Alternative, I could trade it, but I'm probably just gonna sell it, to be honest. Uh, to the space station! New reward available. I should pick that up as well. We'll head... Um, I've already taken a longer on this than I needed to. Uh, space station. Uh, this was just a not smart maneuver. And I'm pretty sure that's locked onto a base rather than a station. Yeah, I just want to lock onto the right thing before I warp there and just fly past. Gotta stay hydrated. Yeah, I'm locked onto a planet right now. Can you lock on to the station, please? Oh, I was in red there. Okay, again, we're on the planet. Copper, gold, magnetized ferrite. Nothing too exciting. Um, this is a starter system. Not too worried about that. Come on, just... Need to get my pulse engine up as well. Travelling at these speeds again. Oh, it makes you really appreciate, you know, the saying, you don't appreciate, it's like, oh, you know what I'm saying. You don't appreciate something until it's gone. You don't, or, yeah, you don't truly appreciate something until you, it's gone. Uh, AKA everything nice I have in my main save. And we'll probably bitch about for the next however long I'm playing this save. Or until I replace it with better stuff, potentially, because I know everything is much more generous in expedition mode. It feels like, anyway. So this is a Corvax system, I think, based on what I was seeing earlier. Hopefully. Ah, what is it? Ooh, look at all these people. Yep. Normally I would fly another kind of ship, but as I said in the beginning, Explorer is going to be good for me. We'll get a good Explorer. We'll get some uh, S-Class modules of all this stuff. 
I think the way to progress early game is to speak to people. <laughs> and let's pick up that. Yes. How do I pick it up? Oh. Collect reward. Ion battery, starship launch fuel, pilgrim geo bay, and an inventory slot. Very nice indeed. Okay. So I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna do my cargo. Or do I do it here? No. Because that's the expensive ones. Uh, I'm not gonna get a geo bay just yet. Ion battery. Ooh, okay, that's nice. Land on the derelict freighter. New mission. How did I visit you before? Um, let's pick up some missions. Level 1 Corvax. That's for frigate fuel, so that's useless. Take a photo on an airless world. Kill 13 creatures. Look at that unit, though. Um, those units kill. Actually, that's double the... Let's do... See if I can pick up both. Yeah. Yeah, let's do it. And then let's do... <laughs> Two birds with one stone. Because we really need the units. Um, Alright, let's get to it, I guess. Carbon. Yep. Look for red and green dots in the analysis visor, blah blah blah. Because yeah, we just can't afford. <laughs> Straight up can't afford the microprocessors. I only need a few more. So let's find the. Oh, damn it, it's now trying to get me to do that derelict. I could hit freighters for money. Bountiful moon. And you are mechanical planet. Let's go for bountiful. Um, maybe once we've got some weapon systems up, I can pillage a freighter. Unless that's going to hurt me in the wrong, lo the long run, meaning I can't befriend a faction easily. We'll, we'll have to see. Okay. Um, let's just land somewhere then. And. area not clear. <laughs> this is where trees just like spawn inside you. Yeah, anywhere you like. Touchdown. Am I just in the ground right now? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that is what I thought. We're just in the ground. Um, oh my goodness. Come on. Just spam the X button. Funding area not clear. Well, if you would show me what's here. Uh, this plant's cursed. Hopefully this guy has a landing platform, not because I can't afford to land and take off again, but simply because I can't land on the ground, it seems. Is this going up? Oh, come on. Alright. Oh, this is quite clunky. Right. Yes, let's go to this one. This one probably is going what I need. And then we'll just kind of walk about killing things. Try and get some units, buy some microprocessors. 
Um, ideally, I would like mines to just sell stuff. But if there are no mines in the area, I can't just magic them up. So that doesn't seem very hospitable, though. <laughs> the other planet. Let's see what these people have built. That looks like players. Oh no, it's a bio Ooh, plants. I can sell plants. Please have a landing pad. Please don't make me land on the ground. <laughs> I came all this way. The hospital. Oh, the frames are kind of like crapping out on me as well. Okay. Alright, so you're just going to land here. But you wouldn't land over where I was before. Right, be like that then. Alright, let's take shelter inside. Because there is a storm and I don't feel like dealing with that at all inside. It's got an aquarium. Cool. Oh, but it's one of these big buildings that doesn't count as a... We're gonna have to navigate very carefully then. Fuck it. Man. Is this really just a... How do I get to this stupid... What is this? Is it a teleporter? Just a ring. I'm guessing these are all... For the individual, I can't just... Yeah. Yep. How does one get to the plants? There we go. This planet is not being kind to me whatsoever.
There we go. Everything <laughs> should be back up and uh, somewhat normal now. At least there's no storm. Right, let's get those stupid plants and get out of here. That looks like a sentinel that's gonna cause me trouble. Joy. Oh, my frames are just not having a good time in this base, so let's get out of here. Uh, this is the problem with multiplayer. What are these? I need the gauntlet. Of course I need the gauntlet. Yep. Wait, can I not just... Huh. That is... Insanity. Why do you let me do that? Well, that's some good amount of units for me, because I'm pretty sure Gravitinos are certainly worth my while. Health at maximum. Alright, let's let's sell these. See how much we can get for them. <laughs> That's even at minus five point seven demand. Oh boy. Give me the units, boss. Uh I think we needed three. So we already had two, so let's just There we go. Got ourselves those microprocessors, and now let's get on our way before the game crashes again. Um, nice, nice, thank you, guy. You're very generous, generous. Sorry, contributions to my campaign. Let's just save, coming in and out. Let's get off this laggy shithole of a planet. Um, we can kill the things later build stuff in space so let's just go into space where it's not oh look at all those bases no wonder my game is freaking out let's just get out of this system uh so hyperdrive i suppose the next thing is it will want fuel yeah so what do we need we need antimatter now to get antimatter, we need condensed uh, chromatic marble. <laughs> Can't speak. You know what I mean. Let's see how we're doing on the cull creatures. Uh, expedition. Leave the initial system for the first time. Storage augmentations. Lovely, lovely, but I need some condensed carbon first. And there was something about a derelict freighter as well. Beginning docking approach for it. It was too far away to begin docking. There's docking approach. Oh wait, is docking approach different from landing sequence? I, I've never seen docking approach, or just never really noticed it before. Maybe it's when you try and warp into a station and it stops you. That's probably what it means. Right. Uh, let's see if we can buy condensed carbon. Cause just I'm sorry. I'm just too lazy. <laughs> buy items. Oh, he's gone. Everyone's gone. <laughs> oh, no one's sky never change. We can always make. That's not a terminal, is it? Yes, this is the terminal. I don't think we can just straight up buy what we need.
Uh, I'll buy like five of these as well. Now that I've got the money too. Yeah, okay, we're gonna have to go and get some carbon. It was inevitable. Now I have to go back to the planet. It's not so soon. What I might do is... I might just grind out mindlessly off-stream. Just not upload that because of a sense. Blighted planet. High sentinel activity. Doesn't say high sentinel activity here. Let's go to this one. Uh, obviously, I do not want to go to the one that has the sentinels because they will bother me and I just don't want to have to deal with them. Detected. What? Oh, is that that giant pink thing that's just appeared in front of me? Condensed stellar ice. What do I do with it? Do I shoot it? Oh! <gasps> Condensed carbon! It's as if it knows. Let's fire some rockets at it. Pew! Yeah, rockets are garbage. How much does that give me? <gasps> yes! Yes, look at that, boys. Oh, that is a good turnout. That is an absolutely fantastic turnout. Um, so let's make some antimatter. And... Oh, you have to be kidding me. Back to... Okay, oh, okay, we can go back to the station. We can go back to the station. That was a great turnout, lads. Oh, see... I must have some good luck today, because that would never normally happen to me. Uh, okay, that's that's good then, because we can buy ferrite and oxygen to make housing. Oh, and some fuel. Let's pick up some. Just give me the tritium already. I also know I have the pyrite, so there we go. Yep. Ship's a bit of a paperweight just now, but... It's the starter ship. I don't expect much of it. Yeah, so... Docking... Approach. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's exactly what I thought it was. Um... Hey, right, let's get what we need. And get out. Go explore, see the galaxy, life, the universe, and everything. I really need to go finish that book at some point. I really enjoyed it. I, I read it when I was on holiday, but obviously <laughs> I haven't had much holidays just now. I really should just read it home, but I just admittedly haven't really done that recently. Got so much else going on, it's just I, I don't really find the time to sit down with a good book. Not like I used to. Uh, do I want to sell the gold? Like, I'm short of resources just now. Oh, okay, okay, right. Let's not get distracted. I came here for oxygen. Let's just buy a lot of it. But nothing too excessive. Remember, just because I have the money does not mean I need it to spend it. Just by I always need ferrite dust, so just there we go. Ridiculous amounts. And as I said, if I need things later, I'll I'll just go and take them from the the poor freighters who are just trying to make a living. There we go. Now we make a warp cell. Now uh, we plonk the warp cell in the hyperdrive and bingo bongo. Oh, that's only like one jump. 
Ouch. Okay, I guess let's make that jump count. Starship <laughs> someone else is farming those freighters. That, that is how you make the big monies early game. Uh, that and doing Nexus missions, but we don't have that yet, obviously, so. Expedition route. Let's go, boys. How many jumps can we make? Out of jump range! <laughs> Ouch! That is pain right there. Did one whole jump. And I'm already out of range. In, an, in a C-class explorer? That's... oof. I'm not sure how it comes across on stream, but there is some funky stuff going on when in warp. Uh, when I watch, I, I might watch a little bit of this back, but I just don't know how much to, um, just to see how things turned out. Because obviously there was that crash, which reminds me, get in and then save. All along this route, there'll probably be people. So at some point, I may deviate just to get away or turn multiplayer off. But it's kind of boring, to be honest. How would I do that? Woohoo! 86 light years. Ouch. That is pain right there. And we got our first milestone, so. Just looking at those storage augmentations, are they for inventory or are sh they for ship? Let's just see, I'll probably recognize them when they pop up in a second. Are they gonna pop up? Nope, they are for ships. Well, I am not going to spend them just now on this bad boy. I'm going to wait until I get a better ship, which is basically anything other than this C-class pile of garbage. Hopefully, later down the line we get a fancy boy, aka anything- uh, I'm such a snob. I used to get on at Zack for being a snob about anything less than S, but really? Anything less than A just isn't of interest to me. Even early game, I could probably buy an A-class now. Uh, I'm not really bothered about getting an S-class. Just a good A-class would do me. What's this, for example? That's a person. Okay, so let's... Lost in space. Establish a base. Discover creatures. Purchase a capital ship. Ooh, man, this is gonna require some money. Explore on foot. Reach the first rendezvous point. Okay, so... Freighter. <laughs> uh, let's just warp about. Um, Okie dokie. What does the base thing give us before we go and try the... Ugh. Line about. And what other quests have we got? Repair kit. Ugh. Uh, log. What have we got in here? Homecoming. Okay, so it does actually show me them. Cool. Ooh, do I have access to the anomaly? Nice, nice! Again, different from the main game. Okay, okay. Uh, 
I don't want to be able to carry everything, so let's see if we can... How much is this going to cost me? <sighs> I'm going to do it though. Yep. I want to be able to carry everything, so... I say let's just go for that. Analysis visor. Alright, let's go after that freighter. This feels like a massive disaster waiting to happen. But you live and you learn. Alright, so I see all kinds of stuff going on here. Uh, let's see if we can't find. I'm trying to use the little thing at the top. It's not easy with all these bases that are flying about. Believe you me. This looks like... an active one, so... Again, I could loot this and start making big monies, but I don't want to make that decision just yet. Can I get specific instructions? Unless it's in a different system. Current mission. I don't really want to waste my <laughs> warp thing me do to, so I guess we just keep going for now. Hyperdrive has no fuel. Okay, let's land into some of the Yep. Some of the ground stuff, like establish a base, kill some things. Petrified. I don't know what's on that, so let's just go for it. What did I drop out of hyperspace there? Landing area not clear. Joy of joys. So let's get to scanning stuff. No, we need to do that as well. Scan all the things. Place a base down. Oh, save as well, more importantly. see any little critters. <laughs> critters. What am I, American? Any creatures roaming in this planet? Well, I have to kill them, I'm afraid. I'm sure that quest is my main one, so I'm not... Actually, let's just get the base down. Yes, yes, establish base. This is literally just for the milestone. Unless it requires me to place buildings. Expand your base. I thought it would be too easy. Uh, there's quite a few red dots over there. We do have a gun, right? Oh, yes, we have a gun. 
Alright, let's go get him, boys. What is that? Whatever it is, I can sell it. Ooh, these big rolly things are the creatures. Why I shouldn't try and do the freaking thing anyway. Oh, it's coming for me. Oh, ho, ho. Like Indiana Jones. Why have ammo? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, man. Scan the things and kill them. Let's not get into a firefight, we can't do it. Is that big thing or one of those things? Cull creatures. Two out of thirteen. This may take some time. Oh, there's another one. Get up! Don't you dare go hiding behind that rock now. There's a few more just kind of like scattered about the place. Let's just start shooting them up. Uh, don't you just feel bad? No. <laughs> no, I don't. I thought they would all aggro on me. So no. They're the weirdest creatures I've ever fought. Doesn't help, my gun is really weak. Should have got some. Weapon enhancements. I know you're one of those things. Start moving. I mean, this is after they nerfed. Was this a bolt caster? Or am I even thinking of the wrong game? It's a bolt caster, right? Yep. A unupgraded bolt caster. <laughs> Wonderful. And I'm only doing 36 damage of pop. Let's hope this counts for both quests, otherwise it's, it's I'm just gonna abandon one of them. Don't know how worth it is. Just exploring, gathering resources. Killing things. Next berry. I know you have value. Yeah, there's a lot of them. Just keep killing. We'll get through it. Ain't no rewind. Oh. Can't speak today. Ain't no reward without some grind. This is too bad. As I said, I've done worse things farming for an SR CPM vector. Some say I'm not even finished. <laughs> Got an A class one, but just. Getting that sweet S class. It's gonna take some time. Oh, there you are. It's so hard because they look so the same, so similar, you know. Wait, I'm a Viking now. I thought it was an anomaly earlier. I guess my head just hadn't loaded in. <laughs> that one? Oh yeah, here he comes. Come yeah, on, take the bullets. I really do burn through ammo like this though. Hexacore. What is that? Hexacore.
Contained reality glitch. Well, it's not valuable. It's not really. I think I would remember it was. Unless it's new. I don't know, it might have some kind of crafting value. Hold on to it for now at least. Die quicker. More of these hexacores. Probably shouldn't have strayed too far from my ship. That's one of those things, that's why. Where did you go? Alright, three more. <laughs> three more of these stupid things. Something requires fuel in your launch thrusters. Only I had my special automatic recharging ones. Oh, this one's moving quite fast. Oh, ho ho! He moving. He grooving. Well, certainly he kicking my ass. The L. There we go. This is jewel. Is that one still after me? Oh, uh, green. So. Oh no. Uh oh. Incoming. Get back. Get back. <laughs> no. Quick, recharge the life support. I said, if I took on a freighter with this weapon, I'd probably get absolutely bummed. It's just not enough damage. Alright, get off me. Right, missions, mission at least accomplished. Alright, let's recharge that precious life support. Return to mission agent. Alright, where's the base first of all? Because I want to. Get that done while I'm on this planet. Probably just waste ferrite, to be honest. And build, like, concrete stuff. Oh, wait, I probably don't have the concrete construction things. Oh, boy. That's something I failed to consider. Let's just save real quick. That scared me, to be honest. I was thinking it might crash. Can never be too sure. Right, let's see what we can actually build. Okay, I can only build wooden stuff. Woo, and I'm not wasting my carbon. Actually, wait, can build 15. Let's just... Build some walls. And then just scrap them, because I know I needed 15 things. I watched you. My what? My smartwatch just told me to wash my hands. <laughs> okay, buddy. Uh, just like randomly, so I plan to scrap these.
could have built something cheaper than wooden wall, but... Hey ho, here we are. Homecoming, established a base. Whoa. <laughs> Milestone met. Alright, now we can just go and just go bonk, 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 bonk. Give me my carbon back. I need it more than you know. There. It was as if nothing was ever even here. Like the war. Nice. I know this isn't the way you're supposed to play it, but what is this? Ooh, that's new. I got some salvage data as well. I could actually go to Yeah, alright, oh well. Um Let's just get back to our ship. See if this planet is horrible. Alright, so we need more hyperdrive fuel. Aside from that, what are we actively working on? We need to discover creatures. I love it specifically creatures, I can't just like... Okay, so that's... let's return to that mission agent. Get some nanites. Okie dokie dokie dokie. How did I say nanites? I meant units. Units. Lovely units. Then we can start working towards getting ourselves. Actually, no. Freighter we can get for free by just kind of flying about. Let's work on our ship, I guess. I would like to get a better explorer than this hunk of junk. <laughs> And then I'll just buy a new one and then scrap this one for what it's worth. Probably not a lot. Um, so as we have the condensed carbon. Let's just make some antimatter, to be honest. And then just... Do warp cells. <laughs> Kinda depressing. But let's first see if we can pick up a new ship that is better than this awful C-Class. Let's do this one first in case it messes up the other one. One easy mission for the price of two. Or two, or whatever. Uh, I'm not doing any more kill stuff. Not doing the photo ones because they're just stupid. Missing person. Yeah, let's not do any more missions. So we've got a nice little chunk of units. It's not much, but it's it's honest. Interesting, no ships are coming in out. I suppose we're not actually going to get much in here. We should have gone to a Corvax system for a good explorer. I guess we should just be on our way then. Take what we can from this system and be off. Yeah, that works for me. Then I'll try and find myself a nicer ship. Is it really only just... Ooh. Land on the derelict freighter. Don't see no derelict freighters. I have to find one first, I guess. Out of jump range. 
Ouch. <laughs> Right, this is a Korvac system. Let's try and get a new explorer, because doing one jump at a time is painful. If that means I have to work more to get him. Then, then we'll see. And maybe mm, scrapping may not be the best idea. Let's see if we can exchange, because there's not really any upgrades on this ship anyway. I think anyway. And unless there is, in which case I'll totally scrap. And there we go, another jump complete. Oh, and a freighter. Oh, this is nice, nice. Okay, let's. Ugh, got rubbish weapons. Nearby freighter under attack. Let's get it, boys. Five, so it's probably going to be a, a C class, but we're not worried about that. Right, let's get close and take him with the rockets. Ooh. That one, that one shot. Wow, rockets actually are useful at close range. <laughs> well, at least for NPCs, but... Yeah, I don't know, I still think they're pretty useless. In, like, player PvP? Yeah, they they are utterly useless. And late game even more so, because you have the other weapons that can just one shot anyway. Or pretty much one shot. Give me your goods. Uh, alright, there's one there. I don't want to hit this ship with my rockets, though, so I might go in manual. And get close. Oh, miss. Problem. Wait for it to come on an attack run, and then... One. I'll wait for that overheat to go down. Two. All of them. One left. Let's not hit the other guys. There we go. Easy. A little bit too easy at this level, but hey. Rockets. Apparently our early game meta, I guess? I don't understand a word what he's saying, so... Let's just go in and pick up his... Juicy Freighter, and that will be another milestone. And then I suppose we should start sending on missions pretty quickly because I imagine there's do a large number of frigate missions and they take real world time and I don't have much real world time so I think it is best if we start planning ahead getting stuff on the go or maybe not but I just feel if I've got to do, I think it was like 20 frigate missions, and each takes like a few hours. Like, I don't have that time. I want to say a few hours, I'm talking like 24 hours. I just don't know if it's meant to be. If there's things like that. Inspect freighter, please give me your freighter. Oh, it's even got stuff on it. Yes, give me that rubbish freighter. Hey! Captain on deck. Acquire the capital ship. Excellent. Inspect my fleet. My fleet's current specialization. Okay. Let's upgrade console. Warp map. Manage fleet. Whoa, we have a mining ship. Great. Absolutely wonderful. This is not gonna go down well. Yeah, yeah, I know I need that. I'm just not gonna do that just now. 
Uh, expedition? Where are we at with that? Does this skip me? Ooh. A pretty amount of units, too. Alright, let's put this... how do I quick move things again? Quick transfer. Yeah, let's keep that. And explosive drones, let's put that in my freighter too. Yeah, now we've got a good amount of money, I really need to go pick up a better ship. Uh, I don't know what the going price for a good explorer is these days, but it can't be that bad, can it? I think. Oh, I just saw some ships just burning about. Obviously not. I need to find a planet that's just not been touched, so I can just go in and scan all the creatures and that'll be that one done, and then we'll pretty much be done. That first little bit of the expedition, unable to visit base station proximity, my ass. Alright, whatever. Just watching time as well, I always say I have very limited time when I'm on here. so. Ah, so I'm quite worried that I don't know if I'll get all of this done, but if I can at least get phase one expedition done today, that should be good progress. I just feel as we get further and further along... Ooh, there's one, let's hope that's not a flare. Uh, I, I'm not caring about colour or design, I just want practical ships. Nice warp ranges. Oh, and it's gone. Yeah, this is just not helpful at all. Uh, I guess what we do is we wait. We wait for a ship. Maybe speak to the Corvax, get my stuff up, or learn some words. Maybe get some resources. This is a Viking. I'm pretty sure he's for... Yeah. Dialect help. Start learning words. I can't hire you, so that's... That's a shame. Offer a gift. that. Yep, someone else's ship. I swear this is just not working very well. I bet that's... Those are two shuttles. What am I going to do with a shuttle? Research entity. Are you the guy who wants to be hired? Oh, damn it, which one is it? <laughs> yeah, let's just ignore all of them for now. Nope, I already visited you. Practice dialogue. Gotta pick up all these words, man.
cards are the way forward. And then we'll try practicing on him. Practice language, please give me something. Knowledge. <laughs> Nanites, wonderful. Alright, let's see what we've been offered in this. What is that? C. 1188. It's better, but it's not worth jumping for. Thinks we might just have to keep going. Really, it's all about getting to the next rendezvous. Scanning. That's our goals right now. What's happening just now? Just some pirates. Come on. Where are the pirates? Oh, wait, no, that man's just attacking what? is the place around my freighter. <laughs> Lovely. It's fine, it doesn't hurt me in any way, so... Go for it, buddy. Go for it. How far away is the expedition thing? Probably quite a few jumps, as I said. When I'm going one jump at a time, it's just... It's just not good. I really need to get another ship. I think at this point, if I could even get a B class, I could live with that for now. I could go for a crash ship, actually. In Corvax space, most likely to be an explorer. Or even, let's be honest, a shuttle. A shuttle with a better hyper hyperdrive range than this, I would go for. I just need that hyperdrive range so I can actually go places. Which makes me think I should have gone and looked at those fighters, but... My goal is to just stick to explorer class ships. And by doing that, I should be able to find something with an insane range and just fly through the galaxy. Literally and metaphorically there. Conflict level high. <laughs> great, great. Um, here, let's just go to the space station then. Oh, there's a guy there though. I might have to turn multiplayer off. I know it will break the experience, but I need these ships to spawn and people from my experience, tend to mess things up, yep. Especially seeing as they take up a lot of the damn landing platform slots that I need. Free, so people can land. Let's check. Yeah. Both those guys are rocking out. Um, hyperdrive range less. That's a B-class shuttle. Oops. And... Ooh. That is an exotic, though. Uh, how much, how much is he gonna charge for? I'm pretty sure it's because it's an exotic. It's oh, yeah, that happens a lot. I might need to turn off multiplayer looking like that. <laughs> 
friendly help for you. <laughs> this guy, I can't see this going wrong. Oh boy. I am very much hedging my bets here that this guy will drop me some some goods. Uh, oh no. These C-class explorers. That's obviously his starship. It's not a good enough upgrade to make me do it. Oh no, we're all going in the back room. I don't know, that's just such a strange name to have. I mean, I'm curious, I want to go look. This could be an absolute disaster, or if it's someone willing to give stuff, it could be... Let's hope there's very little discovered on this planet. Well, it does look like it's going to be water. In which case, no. Abandon. Is this a water planet? With like an iron brew ocean? Oh, it's looking like it. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Abandon. <laughs> Abandon the planet. Uh, let's see what we can look at. Zero a bit fauna discovered. Zero of twelve. So what's this? Human planet. Let's see if we can get over to that human planet. What does the human planet look like? No idea. Is that this one over here? Good old No Man's Sky navigation. Right, we're switching to first person for this because that is just the way to do it. I'm not looking at that, I'm looking at this. Noxious planet. Where's the noxious planet? Yeah, so that would be the overgrown one. Where am I? Oh, I've completely lost it out. Ooh. Wait, that's a rainy planet now. Oh man, I've really lost track of where everything is. What's that in the distance? Human planet. I was going in the entire wrong direction. Right, let's go this way. It's now quite far away though. Maybe in Expedition 2. Um, We'll get more of a focus on getting a ship. Oh, it's got aggressive sentinels. It all. It all. Let's go 
quickly looking up what I'm doing. Piece one. Oh man. Yep, that requires fi okay, this is not looking good. <laughs> okay, we're gonna have to start. <laughs> picking things up then, because there's a lot of work to do. Um, Alright, let's hop out here. Let's set that as our current goal. Just scan everything that moves. Yes, yes, I hear you, Extreme Sentinel Planet, blah blah blah. Oh no, he's here with me! Quickly then. I'm gonna scan all the things. Scan all the things. Scanning, just keep scanning. Scan, 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 scan. All right, what are the planet stats we're looking at just now? Two out of twelve. Great, we've got some underwater ones as well. This could take some time. That said, if we just keep scanning everything. When we see a question mark, we just pick it up. Am I getting credit for the... Scan all the things. Scanning. Just keep scanning. Just scan all the things. Yeah, they don't count. Um, just take the gravity no pulse. I need. Actually, no. This is the aggressive Sentinel planet. That would be a disaster. Some of the fishy boys. Whoop. Yeah, there's some birds. Birds. Not the birds. Come on. Alright, I got you that time, didn't I? There we go. Another one bites the dust. Going. Just keep exploring and seeing what horrible things I find on this planet. 7 out of 20 though. Yikes.
already got you. <laughs> Don't think we'll have to go a bit deeper in the water to find any more more fishy boys. What's that over there? Got you. Ooh, another one. Get him. Like Pokemon. Gotta catch them all. Armored clam. Now let's get down there. There'll be some fishy boys. There we go. Get them all. Ten out of twenty. Before I end up spending more time down here. Oh, okay, let's go that way. Saw you a second ago. Are you? Just scan all the things. I see one. What's that? There was a red dot right there in front of me, briefly. Incredibly briefly. Come on, show yourself. Keep it sentinels. It's off. Just scanning things. Just like you're doing. Being an ass. Can you just... Why are you angry? Because I'm scanning. Alright, well I'm going to take your Gravitino balls. How do you like them apples? I barely got any of the things on this planet. I guess we're going back to the next one. Because I just have to keep going, and I have to keep going, and I have to keep going until I've got them all. This gravity balls, there we go. They're worth money, so let's lift them. Don't even do it. Urgent. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I also forgot they're much more aggressive now. Come on, bring out your nighttime creatures. I know there's still plenty on this planet. Yeah, 7 out of 12. No! It crashed again!
You have to be kidding. Okay, right. We should be back now. Moment of truth, though. When we check. Oh, <laughs> it didn't save. You have to be kidding me. And we're out of hyperdrive fuel. Oh, it is not a good day. It is not a good day. Systems mapped. Yep. Alright, let's just go... Go nuts. And everything. Yep. Mm, it's times like this that makes me just want to not play. Damn it, No Man's Sky. I, w I want to! But when you crash and make me lose all that... ...progress that is just a piss take to get, it really begins to annoy me. Yeah, I know I didn't get that thing, but even still, getting some of these things. Ah. I, I I don't know if I even want those gravitational balls now. Uh, Any fishies? One and two and three, four, five. Once I caught all the fishes and skinned them alive. What am I scanning? I don't think I'm scanning the right thing. All right, let's let's start getting ridiculous about this. This is. Hey, have I got you before? Nope. Just keep going. Just keep scanning. I'm gonna... I'm, I'm kind of pissed off about losing that. But... Some things just happen. Nothing you can do about it. No point in being salty. Let's just go back to being ridiculous about saving. Scan life forms, rename, and ask up. Yeah, fuck you, sent. I'm taking your balls. Yeah, that's right. Mine. What are you gonna do about it? Yeah, upset. I mean, they get upset when you scan shit, so I'm just gonna keep going. Stealing. We do, but steal. Keep going. Don't stop and get in my ship. But they're actually gonna hit me. Oh, they are actually gonna start damaging my shield. Well, not if I'm flying away. Searching and then we'll just take off rather than get me some to fly a bit low. Out. Good old techniques. I said flying into space is just kind of. It's not as good. And you just send the new ones after you. I don't know why I did that to be honest. 
Great, Sentinels have done some shit, they just kill the most of us. We've flown a little bit. Let's actually pull the band real quick. See if we can pick up those last few fauna. Restore point saved, restore point saved, restore point saved, but all your progress is lost. 5 out of 12. How have I only got 5 out of 12? I feel like I got more than I did last time. That is weird. Except now it's just the rare ones I need. Joy. So much joy. This one brings joy. This one does not. And it reminds me of the Hanar from Mass Effect. Oh my goodness, I'm looking forward to the Legendary Edition. He says, but he hasn't even pre-ordered. I don't know. Just a lot to play just now. Maybe by the time I've not got a big backlog of games, I'll get it in a sale. <laughs> oh, screw you. It's not even gonna bother. Keep scanning. Scanning all the things. more red dots please I need to scan all the red dots <laughs> when you get excited after seeing a rock in the sea I really should craft a manual save beacon. That would say, oh no, don't even. Curious suppression. Piss off. Wonder if it's scanning me. Yeah. Okay. It scans you and then it gets pissed at nothing. So it wasn't the fact I was scanning earlier, I was just doing nothing. Kind of worse, I was gonna ignore them. Maybe they'll go away. Until they start actually doing real damage to me. Put another one down. Oh, how many stupid creatures have we got now? 10 out of 20. Whoa, we're halfway there. Let's save. I think we've got the most of them. Let's just not get greedy. Let's summon our ship, which has no fuel. Fantastic. Fantastic, truly. Um, right. What gonna do about that then? Steal more gravity balls, I guess. Okay, this doesn't help me. It kind of makes my situation worse. Yeah, hello Mr. Sentinel, don't, don't bother with me. Oh yeah, now they're shooting. Now they're I need to save, and that's why activating this thing's a mistake. Yeah, my fr the way my frames are going just now, I'm very worried I'm going to lose all my progress again. In which case, I quit. <laughs> if I lose my progress again, I'm done for the day, I'm sorry, but it's just... Liz, I just, I want to get this done. 
it's painful as it is. And I know, I know there's the 15 stupid um, frigate expeditions you have to do for one of the phases. I know it's, I know it exists. You can't hide it from me. <laughs> so I probably should get that started as soon as possible, but I've only got one like dinky ass little mining frigate right now. And it's probably not worth my while. I don't know, we'll figure things out. Just focus on the current objectives rather than the future ones, I think is my way forward. That may be incredibly short-sighted and I'll, it will bite me in the ass later, but... Right, let's keep getting more Gravitino balls. They're already after me. What are they gonna do? That's the game. This is not going to be charged, is it? And that was the problem. Right, save, save. There we go. Now we can do whatever the one on, so. Yeah, you just keep shooting me. My shields can take it. Alright, up, up, and away to the space station. We'll plan our next. Bit. Oh, let's go before they can get us, though. Yeah, they're gonna make me jump out of... Yep. Let's keep going, though, just ignore them. They probably won't even get my shields down. Just keep flying away. Yep. I'm literally able to pull away. I'm great. A great mechanic, no man's sky. Hydration. Yep. I'm probably not gonna go for much longer. 30 minutes of just farming a ship may be enough. Getting something that can actually warp without being out of range already. One jump is just disgusting for an explorer. I know it's a starter one, but it's still disgusting to me. After having a fighter that can jump an incredible distance on its own without any modifications, aka my classic A-class vector without any mods, it's just it's disgusting to me that an explorer, a ship that's designed for warp, warp travel, can't do it. Alright. Lost in space. I, I still don't have that thing on my map. What's going on with that? I just realized I've been flying first person as well this whole time. Didn't even moan and like, complain about it. Maybe I'll just stay in first person. Maybe. Just maybe. Alright, so there's some ships here. Let's take a look at what we can get. Bearing in mind, money is not really an object. Just that's a person. That's also a person. That would be two people. What about this one? That's also a person. What about this machine? That's also a person. Is that the same person? Yeah, he's got two ships here. This is why I need to turn multiplayer off. I think that is what I'm going to do. Because it is now just getting incredibly ridiculous that I cannot achieve that kind of... Alright, let's get rid of this. Don't know what's up with the hex cores, so I'm going to hold on to them. Repair kit, keep that too. Hexberry, get rid of that. Rust metal, hold on to for now. Goop, because oh, no, it's not nice now. Gravitino balls, a lovely chunk of money. Right, so let's do. Right, save first, actually. Then we turn multiplayer off and we look for a good ship. 
Maybe a mistake. I don't think it is. Plan for the day. That's all that matters. At least just now. It's work. Bonk. And they're all gone. Okay. Let's farm us a ship. Minimum of a B class is reasonable. What kind of system is this? Conflict high, comfortable economy, Corvax manufacturing should give us reasonable odds of getting an explorer, but as I said, fighter will, or let's be honest, even a hauler will do. As long as it's B-class and has higher warp range. B-class minimum, sorry. Uh, let's speak to the Gek while we're here. Yep, let's just keep learning all the words while those stupid ships spawn in. It'll take a few minutes. That is just the No Man's Sky way. The longer you stay, the better things get, so... Just keep giving me the words. I'll be mindful of any ships that come in, though. How have I visited you already? What? I said I visited him, but I was like, how is that possible? I just got here. Get back on that No Man's Sky grind. <laughs> Just learning words. I should also be doing practice dialogue, he dialogue help, you know, but... I'm not. I thought I heard a shit fly in there. I'm more confused as to why I haven't really been seeing ships. I thought it was a multiplayer thing, but so far I'm just... Not really working out. We'll keep farting about for a little bit. Just keep learning all, learning all the words. How is there a save beacon? My multiplayer is off. I don't know what's going on, man. Let's hope for the texturing on this Gex face as well. Is he deliberately like low res or? The fact there are still multiple save beacons is. Uh, I didn't want that at all. Look at them. <laughs> Look at the map, right? Pilgrim. I think I need to restart my game. No ships are spawning. This is getting ridiculous. Um. <laughs> Derpy Viking right here. Rocket boots! I don't have that stuff though. A life support module. I will take that. What does it give me? Solar panel power. <laughs> okay, oh, I've actually got a movement module. Did I get that just now, or? I honestly couldn't tell you. Jetpack tank, boost power, recharge rate, sprint recovery time. Nice. Yeah, so it's just my ship. I can kind of hear that sound the ships make when they come in. But I'm not seeing any ships, so it's bugged. And I'm not just making do with the ship right now. There's nothing wrong with reloading. Everything is fine here. See, I've only got one hour forty into the save. Oh man, time is going slowly. 
said it was like absolutely nothing when I got 50 hours into my main save. You just kind of... It just feels like it's happened quickly without you even noticing. But this, this feels like... I, it's very different from the main game, but it feels more like a slog for some reason. Really hope I don't have to start a new save for the next expedition as well, but... We'll see, we'll see. So, right now I'm not really caring about what's on this save. My plan is to just dump it. Because, um, all the stuff you earn from this is account-wide. So nothing to worry about there. Yeah, all these things are still here. Why? And the fact no ships have come in. Ah, there's something not right about this. Can't tell you what, though. Yeah, let's see if there's any hydraulic wiring and then we'll head out. No, there's not. I didn't think there would be. Let's see, can I access the teleporter off the bat? Huh. Nanite refinery. I honestly can't believe I can see these. Farmville. Oh, uh, come on, please be. Uh, no, no, leave alone. Let's just let's keep going. Oh, look, a ship. What a rare thing. See, it's a C-class fighter, though. Yeah, it's like it's deliberately trying to. Chromatic metal. Fuck. Oh, what is that though? Ooh! Hyperdrive range 101. It's it's got a worse hyperdrive range than what I wait. 101. 101. Ouch, man. Ouch. Should have taken that other one while I still had the chance. These, are, these hyperdrive ranges are all rubbish, aren't they? Like it, it's the lowest value or something. Or it's just glitching out. That's the possibility. What am I in here for again? I was looking for something. Chromatic metal. Or copper. Or copper. Copper is nice. Now we just have to refine it. <laughs> oh, how are we gonna do that though? We have to go back to the planet. A planet, any planet. Yeah. Or do I want to just sit here and just farm? I'm getting ships now at least. I think the restart has fixed it. Now that I'm, you know, I'm suddenly getting ships when I wasn't before. Or it's just a complete coincidence and they all just came at once. It's a possibility. Huh. Let's see, I realised my mic was too far away to hear any of what I just said, basically. At least I think it was. Let's just go for a random base. Is it really worth it though? Can I, all right, can I place a refinery up here? I cannot. I can on my freighter though. Uh, is it really worth it to me that much? No. No, it's, it's not. Let's go to a planet. Oh, 
Let's just go to the first base we see. Hopefully they have a normal person refinery there. And I can just use it without having to pay carbon costs. I think I may have to contact my EPM friends for some off-camera work after this. Off-camera? What am I talking about? I'm streaming. <laughs> Off-stream work, shall we say. Yeah, even before I come back with like an S-Class ship and like a billion units. No exaggeration. No, I'm not going to do that. I'm just... We'll, we'll see. We'll talk to them. I'll talk to them. Please have a refinery. Please have a refinery. Uh, that's not a refinery. But it is a teleporter that might take me somewhere. Oh, come on. What is going on on this, like, funky ass house? I should have just taken the teleporter, shouldn't I? It's weird. It's like I've never seen a base like this before. Oh man, it's loading in. Alright, they have all this crap. There must be a refinery somewhere. There's a nutrient processor. Why would they not have a refinery? <laughs> scares me when I use a save beacon and it suddenly looks like it's gonna crash and you're like, no! Construction thing. There's some plants at least. Oh, and it's not in one of those greenhouses things, so I can't just... Yeah, alright. Oh, don't go down the ladder. You're not gonna be able to get back up it. Where are you going, like... Is that a refinery? <laughs> so desperate for a refinery. That's... Not what I was after. Just checking each floor as I go. Nothing. This is the plan I can exploit here, hopefully. Nope. Wait. No. It was not. Come on, man. <laughs> Don't be like that. Just let me get your plants. Yeah, I need the hazmat. I really need to pick up the hazmat thing. Disappointing that he doesn't whoever this is doesn't have a refinery. Not that I can see, anyway. There's batteries and stuff back here. Where is... Unless I'm just blind and just walked past it. Right. Sod it. I'm not just gonna keep warping to bases. I'm just gonna place my own one here. Not edit, no edit permission. Oh, it's the consequence of going to someone's base. Yes, I was hoping there'd be two different species there. Get all the fauna. These stupid creatures, honestly. I could not even be looking at them, and I'll still be scanning them once I've locked on, which is a nice feature, because they're just... They're a pain in the ass. Alright, I'm trying to walk far enough away here, so... Hopefully we're now far enough away from the base where I can plop down a portable... Nope. Because that is someone else's thing over there. Where's that NPC base? Yep, things are loading in. Yeah, things are very much still loading in. Wouldn't be surprised if I just crashed right here. <laughs> That's why I like... Oh, it's one of the... Oh, man. 
the Artemis things. Can I place a refinery yet? Because no one should be able to build here. So I'm gonna. Alright, let's just make a shit ton of... Uh, no. Regular carbon, please. I need the condensed carbon. Right, make me some chromatic metal, please. Life support power low. Cool. Anything else I can steal in here? Just a chair. It's been. Search the plant. Get some more carbon. Always nice. Let's quick scan. There's another. Another creature I can scan. I think we're getting. We're certainly getting closer and closer. It's just taking a long ass time. They're actually forcing me to, like, document shit. <laughs> that requires time. It's not something you can just skip. Unfortunately for me, anyway. Maybe people will enjoy this. Like, Matrix. <laughs> Mr. Explorer Extraordinaire. Oh, this is gonna burn through the copper I've got. I may as well just keep, you know... What was that thing? Like a living ship just flew over my head. Just keep scanning all the things. And on the hopes it counts <laughs> later. Well, time is running out for me, I'm afraid. Yeah, let's end it on the next system. Let's take what we need and go. Yep, stop processing. Let's just take and go. Make some warp cells. Off we go into space. Right. Do I have to do it in my... That's why. Well, I've got the navigation data, just... Come here. Alright, we'll just keep, keep on keeping on. My trashy explorer ship. I didn't make the fuel I needed. <laughs> We're just getting further and further away. Alright, let's just make five warp cells. Yes, there is method to my madness to what I just did in case I change ship and just don't end up using it. So only put in a little bit at a time because I'm, I'm quite close. Yeah, a jump out of range? Disgusting, I'd say. Let's see if we can get to that last destination. Just keep warping, just keep warping, just keep warping. And then really hope that things pick up once we get there. Ship-wise.
I think keeping multiplayer off is pretty good so far. We're still seeing player bases, but we're not getting shot at. We're not getting ships stolen. We're just not having to load all those people. Only 323 light years travelled. Alright, on to the next. We ain't stopping, boys. We're so close, I think. How far away are we from the end? I couldn't tell you. Warping a single warp each time is just not efficient. I just need to, I need to ditch this ship. That should be my priority. Finding one is so far been easier said than done. Come on. I think after this jump I'll stop at a space station actually. Save. And then we'll spend the last few minutes waiting for a ship to see. So I'm just looking at the time based on how long this is taking to warp from systems. Going one at a time, I don't think we'll make it to the rendezvous point one today. Uh, I might come on later and just not stream. As I said, come on with some of the EPM boys. Get some work done. Just like the tedious stuff, like scanning the creatures and getting a ship. Oh, that scares me every time it does that. It might even be the case of going and picking one up that's crashed. If I can't get any good spawns. Which is kind of crazy, to me at least. The way Hello Games has set this up, I was not expecting I don't know, maybe, maybe I'm just looking into it too much. Maybe there's nothing changed in that regard, but... Right now, it feels like I'm deliberately having ships just not spawn. First it was bugged, but then even still, the, the ones that are spawning are just... Not good. Maybe I'm in- maybe I'm just in bad systems, because I'm in, like, starter space, but... I don't know. Seems too good. Or too bad to be true, even. <laughs> Alright, restore point saved. Um, I believe my character sitting out watching this. I will be right back and we'll just leave it running so some ships can spawn and then we'll finish up for the day.
I thought as much. Um, no ships. Or, well, I can watch it back and probably see how many flew in and out in the time I was away. Um, I think it's a good point to call things, though. So. Uh, I'll look into if there's any ways I can do things more efficiently. Uh, I just had maybe do a little bit of off work, off stream work as well. But yeah, alright, I'm just gonna close off the stream now. Uh, this will be uploaded to YouTube. Uh, so I'll watch it back then.